I'm Clinton Griffiths with today's Ag Day Minute. This year's wet harvest is causing a new problem right now in farm country, a propane delivery crisis. Iowa, Minnesota, and Wisconsin are all providing exemptions for propane delivery hours of service all in an effort to get fuel to farmers and co-ops as quickly as possible. So now, instead of managing drying capacity for their crops based on bushels per hour, farmers are now having to consider how long they can go before running out of propane or when they can get a refill. Milk futures seeing some increases lately. Class 3 milk futures jumping 29 cents for November last week and 38 cents for December. The result, $20 milk on the board for the first time since 2014. Class 4 milk also trading higher as well. Barrel cheese, it's now jumped 91 and a quarter cents per pound. That's just 16 and a half cents from its all-time high. Farmers in Australia finally have something to celebrate when it comes to the weather. Heavy rain fell in the drought-stricken New South Wales area. It's the largest rainfall event since 2012. I mean, this is the, the highest single day total of rain that we've had here since the end of March, and, and that makes it pretty significant. In January, more than 99% of New South Wales was experiencing drought conditions. That's according to state government figures. For more Ag News, watch Ag Day weekdays on this station or anytime at agweb.com.